Hey beauties, today I'm going to be showing you how I curl my new short hair. If you are new to my channel, my name is Deandra and I post lots of fashion, beauty, and lifestyle content, all of which I always keep affordable. We are bougie, but on a budget around here. So if you are too, hit that subscribe button. I know you're gonna love it here. And let's go ahead and get started with this hair curling video. Happy dance. <laughs> Starting off with blow dried hair, I did actually try out that new viral blow dry routine where you flip your hair forward and blow dry in front of your face. I posted that on my Instagram, so if you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me over there. Anyways, we're not talking about blow drying, we're talking about curling. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is start off with a primer. This is the Eva NYC Main Magic 10-in-1 Primer. I just kind of lightly spray on my hair. Oh, there goes my earring. After I apply that primer, I'm just going to half my hair and tie it up or in my case, clip it up. So the curling iron that I'm using is this five-in-one interchangeable one from Amazon. I've talked about this one before. I actually really, really like this. Since I cut off my hair, I am using a smaller barrel, but that's okay because it came with the five-in-one. So the first thing I'm gonna do on the bottom layer is take it about an inch or two away from my hair and curl it just like that and let it down, smooth out the end. And I'm just gonna have a curl in the middle of the strand. I'm not gonna curl all the way down. So I'll show you again. And we're gonna curl about three times around, let it sit and just drag it down and smooth it out. My ends are pretty smooth, but I do just like to smooth it out a little more. For wider strands like this, I just go ahead and half them. you're just gonna take your thumb which on this side I take my pointer finger so taking your thumb grabbing the first strand and again halfway down about three times around the barrel let it sit and pull it out you can straighten if you want to and then we're just gonna repeat that all the way around curled a little bit lower down on this side. So I'm just gonna try and straighten the ends out. Now I'm gonna start on the top and we're gonna repeat the process. For my front pieces, I do sort of start a little higher because I do want the curl higher, but I do leave out a piece of hair.
again, taking this side with my thumb and curling away from my face. I try not to take too thick of pieces. I'm gonna go in with my Dove Dry Shampoo and just spritz it all over. Hopefully this will help my hair last a few extra days. This is also gonna give my curls some fluff and volume. Let's recurl this side. And again, I'm just trying to keep the curl in the middle of the strand. So you leave a little extra hair out here and a little extra hair out on the bottom. And I'm gonna take this got to be flex hold. I'm gonna go in with this Joyco hair shake. And this kind of keeps your curls separated from each other, which is why I like it. And again, I'm just gonna fluff it just to get more volume and texture. And because I always have to have extra volume, I'm gonna add in this Got To Be Volumanic Botifying Spray Powder. And I'm gonna do it on the under layer. Shake it up, a few pumps in there, blend it in. Look at that. Like I'm running out, I might need to order a new one soon. A little hairspray. And that is how I get beach waves on my short haircut. I really love this hairstyle. Super quick and easy and lasts for a couple of days. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for watching. Let me know if you wanna see how I curl my hair in five to 10 minutes when I am in a hurry. I can definitely get that curling technique up for y'all as well. Thank y'all so, so much for watching. Be sure to follow me on Instagram and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.